When we first made our Astaya in 2015, and then two years later I sort of set out on making um, The Hamlet for the first time, I was really aware in myself that the two stories are similar and sort of operate similarly important positions in the kind of Western canon as it's traditionally viewed and taught. Both are plays about parents and children, about vengeance, about one violent action leading to another. Both plays have questions of madness and sanity, um, and both plays kind of relate all of that back through family. Like Hamlet fundamentally is a tragedy of two families, and The Oresteia is the tragedy of one family. And I think that that's for me why I guess when we started in 2017 to prepare Hamlet, I found myself thinking backwards to Oresteia and sort of was, was interested in drawing through some of what we'd learned on that production forward into how we approached Hamlet. So it was sort of a self-consciousness then about the similarity of the two stories that means that then when uh, Pierre Ardy suggested here that we mount them together, that felt like a very natural double bill. There's so many parallels between these shows and that's why Rob did them, that's why the Armoury wanted to do them together and also in the way that Rob's directed them, there's so many parallels, but it's really beautiful getting to watch them because there's so many visual parallels as well. You've got the family together, you've got this, both shows kind of end on this family portrait um, and how we grieve, how we process grief, how we communicate to each other, how we um, respond to each other and absorb each other's uh, choices and the consequences of those, they are so present in both of these plays. This sort of sometimes feels like the two plays are speaking to one another, questions about family and about justice and about loss and about living with other people. <laughs> um, and Rob is really, really keen that that is something that sort of one feeds the other. And when we were rehearsing in London, um, it was quite bitty. It, we did like maybe one week on one show and one week on the other. Sometimes we were doing some in the morning and some in the afternoon. And they, of course, the themes kind of tie into each other. But also as actors, we are forming these relationships as actors, getting to know each other, getting to see how each other works. And then we get to bring that into the next show when we start that next week. So I think Rob was really excited about those parallels and how in Shakespeare's time, they would have been doing these shows in rep. We would do a run of one of the plays, or we'd have spent like a sort of week having a Hamlet week, and then we'd get to then start on, a, on an Oresteia week. And it was so amazing because you sort of, you'd feel the differences in the kind of, in your mouth when you said the words, it just felt like a different thing. And, um, and I, so I found it really, just a really great experience. I think there is something kind of magic about telling these two huge stories, Oresteia and Hamlet, with the same troupe of actors. This company is incredible. Everyone's very talented. <laughs> so getting to see different sides of people has been a real joy. Um, I think a lot of the time you only get to see a real glimpse of what another actor's uh, capacity is. How many times in your life are you going to get to do this, doing what we do as a job? Like There won't be many times at all that you get to do a Shakespeare and a Greek, if ever, again. So what we're doing together here, the dynamic of all of us together, we'll probably never get again. And that's been a joy with this. That feels quite special with these productions.